Okay, this is the very hard to find MSI 8048 controller board. It has one, two, three, four, five external connectors and a power connector. These are relays. There's a relay over here. We've got 2K of RAM down here. Um, this is an IO port, I believe. I have to look up the number on it. I don't have the number memorized. This is the microprocessor, and this is the monitor RAM. And these relays can be controlled via software and the ports to control um, equipment. When this powers up, with this switch over here, it comes up on the equal sign prompt. So that's how you know it's working. And you have various uh, um, keys that you can press to bring up data. Going to increment through and see the data going. The following test will give you some details on how some of this works. I don't have the manual or the any documentation whatsoever on this, so it's an experiment for me to try to figure out as much as possible. I may get in and buzz this out as best I can, at least find the chip selects and see what turns on what. That give me an idea what addresses things are located at. Okay, this first video just shows that it powers up um, with the equal sign prompt, waiting for commands. This next test is just to display some of the EEPROM data. I'm going to reset it. I'm going to put the program location in there, which is zero. And the, the data that's going to come out is 15045315D5040935938A zero F A F 8A, 0F, AF, etc. So I know the program is reading out correctly to the display. The next, uh, and that EEPROM is in 2K of uh, EEPROM. The next uh, 2K is RAM data. I'll do that test in a minute. This next test is just to demonstrate read and write to RAM. The RAM is located from 800 to FFF. We'll just do a quick uh, test here. Examine program 800. Enter and it got garbage in there. So I'll go back, reset it. Examine program 800. Enter. I'm going to enter 1 1. Next. 2-2, two, two, next 3-3, three, three, next 4-4, four, four. and then I'm going to go back and read that out now. 8-0-0, zero, zero. enter, and you see you got 1-1, one, 2-2, one, two, two, three, three, four, four. So it's reading and writing from the next 2K of RAM, just fine. This thing can also do breakpoints. I'm not sure how it works, but I, I have been messing around with the display a little bit. I notice if you press this to execute or to run, it starts out 800 because that's the starting location of RAM. Press it again though, it, it says RB. I assume that's for setting the breakpoint, although I'm not 100% sure. And you can just enter in the location or whatever, and, and it'll store that in there. But I'm not sure how that function works just showing you that the display now says um, looks appears to show breakpoint such and such. This just, just talking about the keyboard a little bit. There's a reset switch, clear entry, there's an execute slash breakpoint, examine slash modify, program memory, register memory, next, enter, and then there's a tape in, tape out, and then there's a TTY function somewhere in there. I don't have a memory map of this, so I'm not sure how to use those. Also, I'm not sure what the port address is on the connectors. There's uh, five connectors on this uh, ex external connectors, not counting the power. So uh, I guess that'd be six altogether. And the last thing is basically to kind of show how this operates. It took me a while to figure this out without any documentation. But to examine memory, you press the examine button, and then you select program or program memory or register memory. If you select program, then it, now it expects you to enter some data, I mean not data, uh, the location. So you say okay there's the location 0 or you can go 0, 1, 2 or whatever. Um, it only has 2K so I'm assuming that's why there's uh, only three digits there. And when you enter it, it'll show you the address location and the data and then you can go in and change the data and then enter it. If you enter it, it just goes back to the monitor. If you go next, like examine program 0 enter and you want to go to the next location it just sequences through the addresses EP for examine program reset clears it <laughs>